Hey, I'm Matt Perez. It's easy to feel a bit of superhero fatigue with so many constantly hitting the theaters and television. On top of that, it requires keeping up with all the storylines weaving in and out of all these properties, but it's tough not to be excited about the upcoming Black Panther film. It's directed by Ryan Coogler, the guy who successfully rebooted the Rocky franchise. It is a stacked cast led by Chadwick Boseman and Michael B. Jordan. And the soundtrack is produced by Kendrick Lamar, who's just the best. So to get hyped, here are a few pieces of entertainment to check out before Black Panther arrives. During an interview with Fandango, Black Panther's director Ryan Coogler said 60s and 70s crime fiction like The Godfather inspired the film. The story is also influenced by the Black Panther comics penned by ta Coates, which explore power structures and responsibilities of leaders. So with that in mind, how about trying out Mafia 3? Set in a fictional city based on New Orleans circa 1968, the game stars Vietnam War veteran Lincoln Clay, who teams up with a CIA handler as he goes on a revenge quest against the Italian mob following the death of his father, the former leader of the city's black mob. Based upon that mouthful of a synopsis, we can assume that developers cribbed notes from Mafia films like The Godfather. Released in 2016, Mafia 3 was noted not just for its strong characters, but its boldness in not sugarcoating the harsh realities of race in America during the Vietnam era. Lincoln is one of the few black protagonists in games, and the horrors of the period constantly chase him. In the same interview, Kugler tried to classify the film and throw out espionage thrillers like James Bond. What better game to play than Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater? While the entire series excels in its high-tech spy fiction, the third title really indulges in the genre's roots. Set in the 60s during the Cold War, it's the entry in the series most like an old-school James Bond adventure. The game opens with a sultry 007-esque music video about chowing down on some delectable tree frogs. Your arsenal is full of crazy gadgets like a cigarette that emits a knockout gas, and your commanding officer takes time to speak on the merits of From Russia With Love. And as a final game, how about Dishonored 2? Both the Black Panther film and Dishonored 2 focus on a leader taking over a throne from their murdered parent only to have it challenged by a rebellious villain. And mixed in there are some crazy cool action set pieces full of acrobatics and espionage. The series is known for its open sandbox levels and the number of ways to achieve your goals in each. You can use supernatural powers and a wide arsenal of gadgets to play tricks on your enemies and move past them silently, or you can just find crazy ways to kill people with disturbing efficiency. There's no end to the possibilities. I agree with Matt's voiceover, so it's worth good choices. Anyway, thanks for watching.